Hello and welcome to DTWG the prep welcome. Okay, in today's video we're going to be looking at how to find the volume of a pyramid. Okay, so um, this is a question here and to get the formula you can download the GED math formula sheet here to get the formula, the list of the formulas you need for the math uh, test. Okay, it would be on this website. I will leave the link to the, in the video description box of this video link to the website for notes study guide and also to join the facebook group to support you over fifteen thousand members to support you okay and also i do want a one tutorial if you're interested you can also contact me okay that's for math and science now here to find the volume of a pyramid okay the formula okay from our maths gd math formula sheet is one one third B H. This B, this big B is the base area. Okay, so here, this is a base area. And if we see five centimeter here, five centimeter here, it means that the base area is a square. Okay, I mean the base is a square. So we have to find the area of the base, and H is a height. That's from the peak here to the that touches the base. Okay, at the center. All right. So here. We have one over three the base area b is equal to the area of the square and the area of the square is what l square which is what five square and that would give us 25 centimeter square okay so we do this times 25 centimeter square then the height is what six what centimeter times six centimeter okay so from here this three would go um we'll go in six two times so we have 25 times 2, that would give us that would give us 50 centimeter cube. Okay, that's cubic centimeter. So this will be the answer for the volume of a pyramid. Okay, so this is how you solve this. Alright, so thank you for staying tuned to the end of this video. Um, if you have any questions, do drop your comments in the in the comment section. And also, please don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel and give this video a thumbs up and uh, share with your family, friends, and loved ones trying to take the GED test. Thank you so much. And finally, don't forget that Jesus Christ is coming soon. Give your life to Christ, for he is the way, he is the truth, he is the life. He is the one who is going to lead us to heaven at last and give us eternal life through him is eternal life okay through him is the only way you know they said jesus is the only way to god okay is the only way no other mean no other way he is the way okay and uh he is calling you today and letting you know that there's someone you can lean on okay everything that bothers you every burden you're carrying he would take those yoke and he would give you peace and rest okay rest from every troubles or torments in your life he would take it away because in him is the power of life all right in him is life and he has overcome death he has overcome everything for us by dying on the cross of calvary so today please give your life to christ for he is waiting for you all right so thank you for staying tuned and see you in our next video you are destined to win even in your forthcoming ged math test and also in life 